All right, what up? Good morning. Um, today is Saturday, November 13th, 2021. I'm making this video because it is 18 months to the day since I had my stroke. And um, I don't know if this is going to really close it out, but uh, I think my last one was like a year or 15 months or something. I don't know. But um, doing pretty well. Um, just talking about where I've been and where I'm at, a um, little bit of the journey from there to here. So uh, May 13th, 2020, had a stroke. Uh, I was in the ICU for five days, um, got out and <sighs> um, probably about what you could expect. So issues with balance, motor control, um, thinking, uh, hazy, hazy, what do they call it? Yeah, anyway, um, obviously. So, uh, having trouble like remembering, thinking about things, um, feeling emotions and stuff like that. So when I got out, um, again, I was having problems with balance and energy. I think those were my two, uh, big ones that I wanted to tackle first and, uh, start out with just exercising and, um, trying to think and concentrate and, um, engage scammers on Facebook to try to get one over on them, um, which just exercised my brain a little bit. And uh, after two months, I went back to work. So um, probably went back a little too early. It, it was very, very tough, but um, I felt that it was important for me to not um, take the easy way through recovery because I, I didn't think that I would be where I am now. And um, I believe it paid off. Set some goals, um, you know, physically and then also um, personally. And I think a lot of those goals are coming to fruition now, which is making me happy. Like, I apologize for the interruption, but at least he didn't lose control and hit someone in the crowd. So, um, yeah. So, as you can see, the scenery is a lot different than um, my previous videos. That's because I moved uh, from the desert in California to beautiful Pacific Northwest. I'm in love with it. And in fact, probably gonna end up living in one of those boats right there. Let's pick one. But uh, yeah. As far as recovery goes, um, I still do have some issues with my vision. Um, I had the uh, PFO closed back in January and um, so far, haven't really had any issues with that. Sometimes I forget it's there, except uh, I'll find the warranty card in my wallet every now and then and be like, oh yeah, I have that thing. Um, had some x-rays done last week of my chest and uh, nothing to do with the PFO closure, but um, you can actually see it. Uh, it was kind of cool. But other than that, really nothing to complain about. Um, I can say that at the outset, I was really worried about how my quality of life would be affected um, by the stroke. And uh, I mean, there's still issues, but overall, uh, not nearly as bad as I thought it would be. And I think that there's still some room for improvement um, that will actually be realized over time. So I'm just going to keep hitting it. If anything changes, I'll, I'll probably post it up. Um, but as for right now, uh, I think I'm in good shape. Um, the only other real thing, um, what one of the things that really pushed this move along, um, just dealing with work. Uh, I, I think I was a bit of a, was a bit of a bear uh, at work to deal with for some people, um, and they viewed my stroke as a a door to get even. Um, and so I mentioned before that I might have gone back to work a little too soon, which which is debatable, but um, kind of walking back into a pit of vipers is wasn't super helpful. Um, I, I think that um, having to think and process for my own survival um, helped me, I guess, in some ways, but the stress just really isn't that good. Um, but I learned back in, like, April, I think, um, my boss's boss's boss was trying to gin up some um, misconduct charges to get me terminated. So 
that's when I was like, all right, I got to get the F out of here. Um, so I, even though it's illegal and stuff, I just didn't want to fight. I, I was just tired of fighting. Um, but you know, they, they, those people wanted to get their cheap shots in. Um, a couple of them worked and that was fine. But, um, I think by then I was just so disengaged that I wasn't really concerned about my career so much as I was about the principle of the matter. Um, so got the paperwork submitted, got myself out of Dodge. Um, I was going to try to stay with the organization I was in, um, but they were successfully able to block that. Um, so I just got a new job and not a big deal. I'm exactly where I want to be. Um, started the new job about three weeks ago and it was, it's, it's been nothing but awesome so far. Um, so no complaints there and quite frankly, just a good move. So we'll see where it takes me and, uh, whether or not I can get any traction and, and take some of these lessons I learned with me to, to greatness. Um, but feel free to ask questions or roast or whatever. Um, cause I'm pretty much an open book and I know that there's at least five or six people who will watch this video. Um, it is what it is. We'll take care and, uh, hopefully, uh, Hopefully these videos have been useful to somebody. Alright, bye.